Our new tonight, two Thunder Ridge students are trailblazers in the game of cornhole. This is maybe my favorite story of the day. They've now become among the first to receive college scholarships to play the popular lawn game. Your reporter in Douglas County, Olivia Young, introduces us to them. After turning a hobby into a scholarship, two Douglas County teens are taking a toss at college cornhole. Jackson Remick and Gavin Hammond never thought they'd be making cornhole history. No, definitely not. We, we were shocked that we even got this opportunity to take something that we were doing as like a side hobby and something for fun as like a sport that we play in college. Yeah. The pair met while playing in a local bar and restaurant's cornhole tournament. We became friends because of cornhole. They soon discovered a passion for the game and a skill for playing together. It's just very straightforward, but there's also a lot to it. A lot of stuff mentally, um, there's a lot of strategy. Get a comfortable grip and then I throw and do a little flick. Remick and Hammond won back-to-back -back National High School Cornhole Championships, along with two other Thunder Ridge students. We've kind of like made a name for ourselves. It got them noticed by South Carolina's Winthrop University, which flew them out to play a game and make them an offer they couldn't refuse. Two first-of-their-kind scholarships to play on the university's newly created cornhole team. We just kind of fell in love with it from there and we were both excited to take this uh, opportunity and kind of pave the pathway for this to become a college sport. The pair committed to Winthrop on National Signing Day. Their scholarships will cover about 60% of the cost to attend. We're gonna go in August. Yeah. yeah. Now they're counting down the days and keeping their skills sharp. The boys won't just be cornhole partners at Winthrop, they'll also be roommates, and they're hoping their friendship will take them all the way to the National College Cornhole Championships. In Douglas County, I'm Olivia Young, covering Colorado First. That's so awesome, isn't it? I know. There's no stopping them now. No. We're follow them through their their trials and tribulations he, here. It's he awesome. was talking about that flick of the wrist. That is always my problem when I yeah. play cornhole. Yeah. yeah. I flick it and it always like flies way off. Well, you need to keep watching. <laughs> I should, yeah. Pick up some tips. Maybe it'll take some lessons <laughs> that's in your way. Uh, Olivia grew up in Douglas County and wants to hear from you about what's happening in neighborhoods there. She is your reporter in Douglas County. You can reach out to her through our website, cbscolorado.com.